most cars come to the end of their useful life, they usually end up at the wrecker's yard. But a self-confessed car fanatic on the west coast couldn't bear to see such a destructive end to his formerly favourite wheels. So, he planted them. Here's Penny Deans. Joe Gilman and his son Abe are pretty keen on classy cars. Joe drives a rare 1935 Ford V8. In fact, he loves old cars so much that he's turned two of his favourites into a highly unusual memorial. Oh, I had these two cars and I just thought I um, wasn't going to sell them. I saw about it, a chap had done it with some Cadillacs in the States, so I thought, why not? So here they are. So attached to the cars was he, he planted them boot first in the ground at the end of his drive near Stillwater, north of Greymouth. Are oh, they still alive? I uh, <laughs> think about them as I drive past. These are no ordinary cars either. They are prized 1975 and 1980 XJ6 Jaguars. Well, these cars are 100%. They're down to, uh, you could put a battery and turn the radios on. The cars are switching on the tourists too. The gateway's a magnet for people passing by on State Highway 7, stopping by to see this monument to one man's passion. Penny Deans, One News. It's a fabulous gate, now he's just got to find a fence. I'm not going to show how he's going to do that. <laughs> <laughs>